Welcome to another 386 Experience Vintage Technology Review. Today on my workbench I have a 1970s JVC Video Sphere. So this was a, um, it's considered the weirdest TV ever made. So I just picked this one up. You can see it's really glowing. I can see you in the reflection there, or you can see me. And it's um, it's designed to look like a space helmet. Is everything back in in the early 70s was uh, based on a lot of the technology was space uh, influenced due to the moon landing and all the uh, uh, all the um, emphasis on astronauts and the space program NASA. So anyway, this thing. It's a sphere, uh, and that's where they got the name uh, Video Sphere. And it it has a chain here because it was meant to be portable and carried around. And the base is adjustable. You can slide this thing around to different angles um, by kind of moving it. It has on the bottom. It has it has this uh, slider on there that can be adjusted, and you can move it up, down, all around. And um, on the top here, it has the on-off contrast. Oops. And uh, what's this last one? Brightness. Yeah, brightness. And it has the connectors here for the uh, earphone. And then the two radio dials. The antenna here, it's kind of, the little plastic's kind of melted there, but it, it extends out. Um, and on the back, we, we have the uh, antenna connectors and a either the external or the rod antenna selector here. And there's the power cord. And it even has a connector here to plug in for uh, either, I think it was either battery or to plug into your car battery uh, cigarette lighter. Um, then it has the horizontal and, and uh, vertical controls there. And you can see that this is model 3240. And, it's, and it has DC rating here, 11 watts, and then the 120 for the AC. So it's a very unique item. You can even detach this sphere by unscrewing it there and then just carry it around with the chain and take it out to the beach and set it in the sand or whatever you want or walk down the street. You could have TV going. Uh, so it's a kind of a unique item. This is a uh, this is a um, analog television because it's built in the 70s. So when I turn it on, I'm going to turn it on now. You can't get any reception because you need to connect it to a digital analog converter. Uh, but it does work. The sound works. I could turn it up there. So, pretty neat, pretty neat item. Some people have used it to uh, uh, as a monitor. There's a way you can convert it and have it as your monitor or to play as your uh, uh, monitor for either your computer or for video games. That'd be a pretty cool application of it other than just use, using it as it was intended as a television. So anyway, there you go. The uh, 1970s JVC Videosphere.